to be using the Frizzwiz Curl Defining Leave-In, the Sprung Coil, <laughs> what was it? The Sprung Coil Boosting Styling Jelly, and the Frozen Drip and Grip Super Hold Gel. I'm going to be starting with the Frizzwiz and then adding this a little bit of the Sprung and then I'm going to add the gel, the Frozen Drip and Grip as my so I've already split my hair into four sections and I'm going to start by adding a bit of the Frizz Wiz. It looks like this. It kind of looks like shampoo. <laughs> but then when you rub it in your hands, it becomes clear. It smells really good. It smells like candy. So I'm just raking this product in and smoothing. I'm also going to add a bit of the sprung. This smells not as good. It kind of it kind of smells like maybe grapes. I don't know. I'm going to add a little bit of that as well. This is how my curls are, are looking with just those two products, though. They are popping. That's crazy. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited to see how this wash and go turns out. So I'm just going to continue adding the uh, Frizz Wiz and the Sprung to my hair. And then I'm going to come back when I'm about to start adding my gel. This really has my curls popping. Added a bit more of the uh, sprung that I probably should have, but it's really got the curls popping. It's got me wondering if I should just do the wash and go with these two products and use the frozen another time. I think, by the way it's looking, um, I kind of want to do that. So I'm thinking about it. I might let my hair dry for a little bit, see what it's looking like, and if it's not drying the way that I like, then I'll come back and add the gel. I think, I think that's what I'm going to do.
This leave-in has a very watery consistency. You kind of have to add a decent amount, but once you do, you get definition, you get moisture. I like this leave-in a lot. And this sprung is what is really doing it. Like, I feel like I used this once in the past. I don't even remember what I used it with, but I didn't use it right because I didn't get results like this where I would have, this jar would be empty and it is not. I just add it and it defines my curls. They feel so moisturized. I am really just really in love with this sprung. Okay, I'm gonna let my hair dry and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys my results. But this is what the back is looking like. I'm just really loving it right now. I think it looks beautiful. So I hope that it <laughs> looks something like this once it's dry. But okay, I will see you guys later. Bye. I'm back and this is what my hair is looking like once it has fully dried. The definition, the shine, it is on fleek, it's on fleek. We in this beach, finna get crunk. Abra's on fleek, the fuck? This is what the back is looking like. When I woke up today, it still wasn't dry, so I kinda just been letting it do its thing. It's really shrunken, I haven't really done anything to stretch it. So I'm probably gonna do some form of stretching it, whether it's just a stretching bun or I'm gonna stretch it with my blow dryer. So I'm gonna come back on camera once I've done some stretching over the next few days, just to show you how it's holding up. But it, it does have a cast to it. It's not like crazy crunchy, but it has some crunch. And I love that. That means it's gonna at least last for a few days. Okay, well, I'll see you guys once my hair has been stretched and I'll give you my final thoughts on these two products. Hey Curly, so I'm back and this is my hair on day two. Since it's fully dried, my hair is so freaking defined. I did not stretch it with a blow dryer. Instead, I just did like a, a stretching bun. I just took one of these Invisible Bobbles and just put my hair in a bun at the back and I left it like that for probably an hour or so and I did that two times. So that's got me to this length and I like it. It definitely has some volume. It's really freaking cute. Like, I've been sleeping on some tentacles. <laughs> the back is looking like this. I haven't really seen the back so hopefully it's not too poofy. But I am absolutely loving it. Like, uh, you can't tell me nothing. So my hair has been dry for two days. And I think it's only going to get better from here, I hope. It is pretty soft, so hopefully it doesn't get too frizzy over the next few days. But even if it does, I love what it did so far. Okay, so this is my hair on day four. I have got to say like, yes, I have some frizz, but I am absolutely loving this wash and go. I cannot believe I slept on Sultanicals for so long. I bought these products probably in September last year and I really haven't used them at all. I was really sleeping on this Sprung Coil Boosting Jelly. I, use, I have used a decent amount of this. I think it's at about here but this there's like still a lot left and i will be using it up for sure like i have so much definition and i got volume i think this looks really great for day four yes i didn't stretch it with a blow dryer or anything like that i just stretched it with the stretching ponytail and it looks like this so yeah, I would recommend both of these products. This one is very moisturizing. You kind of have to use a lot, but it moisturizes your hair very well and it smells super good. 
this one is very special <laughs> and I would definitely recommend it I cannot remember the prices I will put them in the description um, don't sleep on sultanicals <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe, comment, and share.